Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a DIY on how to clean out your Keurig. So I need to clean up my Keurig anyways. It's been a while since the last time I gave it a good clean. So I figured why not film a video because I know at one point I did not know how to clean out my Keurig and I needed to Google it. So I thought I would share with you what I know and how I clean my Keurig. So now let's just jump right into how I clean my Keurig. Okay guys, so these are the supplies that you are going to need to clean out your Keurig. You're going to need some dish soap, an all-purpose cleaner, a toothbrush, and then also some vinegar. First thing I'm going to do is just take all of the pieces apart. So I will take out the piece where you put all of the water in. I'll also take out where you insert your K-cup. And then all the way in the bottom, there is a little tray that you can remove. As you see, I'm removing it right now. And all of this is, I believe, dishwasher safe, but I am gonna wash it by hand. So now I'm just going to wash all of the pieces that I just removed from my Keurig and I'm going to wash them by hand. Like I said before, I do believe all of these pieces are dishwasher safe, but I'm just going to wash them by hand. Now with my toothbrush, I am going to dip it in some really hot water that I have mixed with a little bit of vinegar. And I'm just gonna wash all around the Keurig and make sure that there is no left coffee residue or gunk that is left in there from brewing all of my tea and coffee. So you're gonna see here that I'm just going to take this toothbrush and make sure that I clean everything. I'm just going to take my all-purpose Mrs. Myers cleaner with a paper towel and clean the entire outside of my Keurig. Now that the outside of my Keurig and all of the pieces are nice and clean, I am just going to put everything back in their place and make sure they are nice and secure. Now I'm going to take my bottle of vinegar, which is a 16 ounce bottle of vinegar, and I'm going to put the entire bottle into my Keurig where you're supposed to put the water and I am just going to brew that entire bottle through my Keurig and this is what's going to cleanse out the inside of your Keurig. Lastly, I'm just going to put some water in my Keurig and flush out all of the vinegar. So do this until you do not smell any more vinegar. So 
that is how I clean my Keurig. As you saw, it is very simple and easy to clean your Keurig. Now, I personally usually give it a good cleaning every three to four months. Now, I'm not sure if you're supposed to clean it more often, but that's usually the time frame that I use. About every three to four months, I do give it a good clean out. Now, I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, please remember to give my video a thumbs up. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, join me and my YouTube family, and also turn on your notification bell so anytime I upload a video, you will be notified. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.